Hello, honey pie. Come away in and see who's at home today. Granny Murray's house has two at home to play. Granny Murray's house is home to. Who's here today? Well, we've got Stephen and we've got Megan. But don't just sit there, my wee cherry buns. Come on, let's get busy. Ah, football! Brilliant! One goal for Megan, but nobody else. Woo! <laughs> well, we've got Stephen and we've got Megan, but someone's missing from home today. Oh, not anymore. Who's coming home to Granny Murray? Oh, it's Raymond with Lisa. Hello there. Raymond. Hi, Granny Murray. Oh. Lisa's here, you too. Oh. Woo! <laughs> so you're getting in the mood for the big football match today? Oh yes, Raymond, we're really excited. River Sea United against Drumtown City. And who do we want to win? River Sea! River Sea! River Sea! <laughs> oh, listen, I'm supposed to be trying to be quiet today. Mr Watson next door's a composer and he's writing a very important piece of music and he's asked me to try and keep the noise down. Oh. Well, we'll do something new anyway. Why don't you dress Claude up as a River Sea United football supporter? <laughs> um, come on, quietly now, Raymond. River Sea, River Sea. <laughs> you know, I didn't know you were a football fan, Granny Murray. Oh yes, I love football. Angus and I used to go and see all the River Sea games. We would stand on the terraces with all the other fans, waving our scarves and shouting, River Sea, we love you! Shh. Remember Mr Watson? Sorry, me and my big mouth. <laughs> you know, he's writing a symphony for an orchestra for over a hundred musical instruments. Oh, well, I wouldn't worry then. <laughs> His orchestra would make a lot more noise than you're singing. Ah, yes, but you know what I always say? When you make a noise, just think of those who want to be quiet. You're right. So, when the match is on, just keep the noise down. OK, Claude? <laughs> Oh, look, Raymond, the River Sea United hat, scarf and rosette. You're our number one supporter, Claude. Let's hope he brings us some luck this afternoon. Here you are, Daddy. Oh, thanks, Lisa. My very own River Sea United rosette. <laughs> I'll wear that when the game comes on. Thank you. <laughs> right, I better get off to work. Come on, you. <laughs> now, remember, when you make a noise, just think of those who want to be quiet. Thanks, Granny Murray. You guys have a fun day. Bye-bye, my darling. I'll be thinking of you. Oh, me too. <laughs> Will you keep a wee eye on Raymond and make sure he goes the right way to work? I'm a bit late for work today. Can you tell me a quick way to get there? Thanks. I'm in, 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 in a hurry. To speed to work. I take a ticket, ticket on the metro. I'll be, 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 be there quite quick. Hurry, hurry, hurry on the train lines. Clatter, clatter, clatter at the points. Whining, whining, whining drives the speed up. Squeaking, squeaking, squeaking slows us down. Clatter, clatter, clatter through the streets now. Squeaking, squeaking to our stop. I'm in, 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 in a hurry. I really, really need to get to work. I'm in, 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 in a hurry. Hurry, hurry, hurry. OK, so we're here. But before I can get down to some work, I have to change. So, busy, busy, busy. All dressed and ready to go. Good luck, River Sea United. Oh, Bobby. Hey, Raymond. <laughs> Big day today. Yeah. Oh, hello, Kai. I never saw you there. So, what can I get you? Um, two orange juices, please. OK. <laughs> so, are you off to the big match? We most certainly are. I see you're a River Sea United fan, Kai. Yeah. <laughs> but what is your mum wearing? Um, excuse me? What do you mean, what am I wearing? Those are Drumtown City colours. Yeah, that's because I'm a Drumtown City fan. My dad was from Drumtown. I've supported him all my life, haven't I, Kai? Yeah. Come on, Drumtown! Come on, Drumtown! River Sea! River Sea! River Sea! <laughs> River Sea! River 
What team's going to win today, Kai? River City! Yay! <laughs> no chance, Kai and Raymond. You're supporting the wrong team, I'm afraid. Oh, we'll see. <laughs> My mum's coming to watch the match with us, isn't she, Kai? Yeah. She's getting on at Molly Moore. I hope she's going to be able to find us. Oh, don't worry. I'll keep an eye out for her. Oh, thanks, Raymond. OK, come on, Kai. Oh, it's a shame I can't go to the match, but I'll be supporting River Sea United from the Buffy car. Thanks again for the rosette, Lisa. with all the football fans going on the train to Drumtown for the match. <laughs> Are you having fun, Daddy? That's great, thank you. Thanks. <laughs> Enjoy the game. <laughs> Thanks very much. So, we'll be at Molly Moore any minute. You made it. <laughs> and I better go on with some hard work. I love my train. Our oh, rushes through the lines, pushes things too far and wide. Wheels go round and round the tracks, drive the edge of their backs. I'm so happy being me, doing all the things I love to do. Chocolate, lemonade, or tea. I'm just very happy serving you. Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day, making special moments on my way. I'll tell a joke and toast some cheese on toast. Oh, I walk, walk, walk all day, bringing smiles and happiness my way. Being nice is what I love the most. Six, six, seven, looking fine. So happy being me, meeting all the people on the train. Can I help you clear your things? If there is a problem, I'll explain. Oh, I talk, talk, talk all day, wheeling trolleys, weaving to the sweet. I'll do a trick and make the journey quick. Oh, I walk, walk, walk each way, loving all the things I do each day. Bringing smiles and happiness my way. I love my train. I love my train. Drumtown already. Well, the time has flown past this morning. We're approaching Drumtown, everyone. Next stop, Drumtown. <laughs> bye, Raymond. Oh, bye, Bobby. Bye, Raymond. Bye. And may the best team win. And that means River Sea United. Oh. Oh. Good afternoon, Raymond. Mickey John, hello. Uh, can I get you something? A very strong cup of tea. Coming up. <laughs> so, aren't you at school today? No, I had a big teacher's meeting in Drumtown this morning. I could have done without it, to be honest. i got a lot of marking to do for tomorrow. Oh, well, why don't you find a wee quiet corner and then you can get on with your marking while the train whisks you back to Riversea Fingal. Oh, thanks, Raymond. That's just what I need, a bit of peace and quiet. Hiya, Mickey John. Hello. Oh, Raymond, do you mind if I listen to the match on the train? Mind? I'd love that. That way I can listen as well. It's going to start any minute now. I'm so excited. Come on, River Sea. Oh, actually, maybe we shouldn't listen to the radio. There are some customers trying to work. Well, that's no problem. I just put my earphones on. See, I can listen to the match without disturbing anyone. I'll let you know when someone scores, Raymond. <laughs> oh, what a shame. I'd love to listen to the match. Oh, well, Lisa, I wonder if you're having a noisy day or a quiet day today. <laughs> I love to skip in River Sea Pingle, River Sea Pingle, that's for me. Right, my darling, we mustn't disturb any of the people working in the library. We have to be quiet as mice. Shh, come on, let's sit down. That's the way. Right, let's have a wee flick through this book here. Oh, it's all about trains. Oh, look, Lisa, do you see that one? That's just like your daddy's train. Look, Sean. Where are you, Daddy? Hello, 
Hello. Ready, how are you doing? <laughs> oh, I'm fine, thanks, mate. Has the match started yet? Oh, kick-off is any minute now. Oh, brilliant. I really wish I was there, Raymond. I tried to get a ticket, but apparently they sold out ages ago. Oh, well, Dr Juno is over there, listening to the match on a radio. Come on, she'll keep you up to date oh, with what's happening. Fantastic. I'll join her. <laughs> We love you, River sea. We do. Oh, River sea, we love you. Just on your left there, Rudy. <laughs> Cheers, mate. Hi, Rudy. Oh, hey, Doc. Has it started yet? Oh, any second now. Oh, oh yes, here we go. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Come on, River sea. <laughs> Come on, River sea. Oh, River sea. Oh, poor Mickey John. He really needs some peace and quiet. But with the match on now, there's not much chance of that. River sea are pushing through. They're through. Oh, Come on, on River sea. It's just wide. Oh. It's a corner. Oh, yeah. Would you mind keeping the noise down, please? Come on, River Sea United! Easy! 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 Oh dear. I've been working hard all day trying to keep everyone happy, but now it looks like it's too late for Mickey John. Oh, where did the time go? At 8 o'clock, I dropped off Lisa at Granny Murray's. We were all very excited about the River Sea and Drumtown match, but we had to be quiet so we didn't disturb Mr. Watson next door. He's writing music for an orchestra. At nine o'clock, I got to work. Bobby and Kai arrived on their way to the match. Kai supports River Sea, but Bobby's a Drumtown supporter. At two o'clock, we arrived at Drumtown and everyone got off for the match. Mickey John arrived. He had a lot of work to do. When Dr Juno got on with her radio, Mickey John didn't look too pleased. Rudy joined her to listen to the match and they got quite noisy. So then Mickey John didn't look pleased at all. And now it's three o'clock and the match has begun. Everyone's excited and happy. All except Mickey John. Now remember, when you make a noise, just think of those who want to be quiet. When you make a noise, just think of those who want to be quiet. I know what to do. I'll make a quiet area for the people who need to work and a noisy area for the people who want to enjoy the game. It's a race against time. I've got to do it, I've got to do it. I've got to beat the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it, I've got to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong. I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song. Do we think he's going to do it? Do the job that needs to be done. Will he know how to fix it? Will he finish what he has the clock before the chime. I've got to sort it. He's going to sort it. I've got to do the job on time. Like a busy bee, I'm going to beat that bong. I'm going to finish this job before I finish this song. Right. All those who want to enjoy the match, follow me for the football special. Oh, wow. That sounds like our kind of place, guys. Come on, Raymo, lead the way. Privacy United! River Sea! River Sea! River Sea! From Toon! River Sea! From Toon! Oh wow, this is brilliant, Raymond! And you can have your radio on in this carriage and no one will mind! Yay! Come on, River Sea! Raymond, thank you. You're a complete star. So, cup of tea for the teacher? Don't mind if I do. Oh, problem solved. Now all of my passengers will be happy for the whole journey. It'll soon be time to go and pick up Lisa. <laughs> oh my, Mr Watson must be finished his work, eh? <laughs> Looks like we can make as much noise as we want, Lisa. Come on! Let's get noisy! <laughs> oh my, that's noisy! Listen, lady, we better get you ready. Your dad will be here any minute. I wish I was with you, Daddy. Hi, Lisa. 
Have you had a great day with Granny Murray? Oh, yes. we certainly did, didn't we, darling? Thank you. Oh, oh. my wee angel! <laughs> And a big thank you from me too, Granny Murray. I remembered what you said. When you make a noise, just think of those who want to be quiet. It saved the day. Oh, bless you. <laughs> Come on now, let's get you two home. <laughs> Looking forward to next time. Me too. Come on, Lisa, let's talk about our time away. And I suppose you want me to tell you all about my time too. Well, there was hugging, squishing, walking, pushing, dancing, dusting, shading, choosing, talking, cooking, drying, cleaning, saving, cleaning, loving, joking, jumping up and turning round, dressing up and sitting down. <laughs> but what was really special about today? Well, Claude was dressed as a River Sea United football fan because today our team were playing Drumtown City, the biggest match of the year. Raymond came to drop Lisa off. We were all very excited about the football, but I remembered about Mr Watson, who was busy next door working on his music, so we had to be very quiet. Later, we went to the park, and there we could make as much noise as we liked. We had a great time kicking through all the leaves. After lunch, we went to the library, another quiet place. When Mr Watson finished his work next door, we danced around noisily to his music. Raymond had his hands full too, trying to look after passengers who wanted to be noisy and passengers who didn't. As I always say, when you make a noise, just think of those who want to be quiet. And Raymond found a way to keep everyone happy. I hope you enjoyed yourself. Me too. Bye bye, honey pie. I love to sit in Down to the city